Yo, what is up, y'all? We're back with another video. I'm actually crunching two videos at the same time, so you're gonna see two videos come out with the same fit. Don't come for me, you know, don't grease. But right now, it's a little awkward right now. I got my boy right here, so for me for his project. Boy, Vic, right here. Y'all can check out his channel as well. He does a lot of funny ass content. So I can definitely tune into that shit. I'll put that shit in the description as well. But I'm gonna show you guys like, how to properly, how to properly paint your grill. Don't don't do the little quick like plaxi dip stuff and a little, little quick paint just put black paint over it and just starts chipping off that shit looks crazy y'all don't do that it looks bad but what we're gonna actually gonna do is uh you know wash it hit it with some alcohol uh dust it off then prime it i'm not gonna actually sand it because i have a, I have a special primer that i got i want to see how good it is hopefully it's good because i'm not i'm coming for y'all with the with the chip one hopefully it's good but i'm not gonna i'm not gonna sand it or nothing i'm just gonna like just prime it off and then we're gonna see how it goes right there. So stay tuned here. If it don't look good, I'm sanding. All right. So as you guys see, the whole thing is gray. I'll bring it a little closer so you can see it. I mean, it's literally just gray. No more chrome. Just gray. I kind of like, you know, it's like dusted it off a little bit. I'm probably gonna take a little can of air and. Hopefully it's no dust in it. And then I'm gonna hit it with my first coat. I have this paint right here. I have high performance enamel. This is black. It's a gloss black as well. And it's pretty good paint. I mean, I use this on a lot of different things. I'm using it because it's also a fast drying paint. It dries within 15 minutes. So that's pretty helpful. Yo, what is up, y'all? We're back here. It's another day. So, I already painted everything. I did primer. Obviously, you know, I did the primer uh, yesterday. Did like two or three coats of primer. Then I went again and did with the black paint. I did about two or three coats of black paint. Only problem with the grill is it has like these kind of like edges. I'll show you guys like there's like these like like these like behind gaps were super hard to get to. And because I'm trying to get to them, I actually made a mistake right here. You kind of can't see on camera really, but if you look a little, let me see a little closer. Everything else is kind of smooth and flat, but then right here it looks a little like wavy and glossy because I have put too much paint on that area. It got a little thick. So kind of want to avoid that, but it's kind of hard with that because like, so like it's, it's a hard surface to kind of paint. It's not a flat surface or anything, so it's really you know, difficult. But what I'm going to do right now is actually put some clear coat on it because I could put this on right now, honestly, and leave it. But that's kind of what happened with like the paint chip and stuff because things like start to hit this, like, you know, bugs and like rocks and all that stuff start hitting this. They're going to like start scratching the paint off and chipping the paint away. And I hate that. Like I said, I, I'm stuck with that, that 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 pink chipping on the grill. Y'all hate that. You know, there's ways you guys go around. You could just wrap it if you wanted to, but wrapping this is probably going to take me a lot longer than it is just to like paint it. So I'm just going to put some clear coat on it right now. After that, I'll you know, probably put a two or three, what, one first light coat, clear coat, and then like two or three coats on top of that. And then like we'll probably, probably install this today. Hopefully, hopefully. Stay tuned. All right, what is up, y'all? So I actually wasn't gonna record this right now. You guys are probably seeing see some crazy background. Let me just stay right here. All right, you got to how it was in the background. So I probably actually wasn't gonna record this right now, but I'm gonna finish up this video because you know, why as well right now? Get out the way. Um, I finished painting it. I was actually gonna put the clear coat on. The clear coat's been on for about four hours now. So about like four hours now it's been on. It really takes 24 hours for clear coat to, to fully cure. So I'm debating if I wanna let it cure right now, like fully and put it on tomorrow or if I wasn't putting it on right now. Cause I already have my bumper off right now and I'd rather just do it now than wait. But at the same time, I also don't want to mess it up with anything. So, so I'm probably going to end up leaving it. Unfortunately, I'm probably going to leave it and not put it on. But I do got something to show you because I have this Nismo badge. And I don't know how some of y'all feel, but if you ask me, and I hate to be one of those guys, if you ask me, the G is basically a skyline. And it's a Nissan product. You know, in, J in Japan, it's a V36, you know, skyline. But, but, if you ask me, I think this will look pretty badass right on the grill. You guys will let me know what you think. I think that's pretty cool, especially with the Chrome Nismo, uh, Chrome Finney logo. Trying not to scratch the paint. 
I don't know. Yeah, I, I think it goes pretty well. I think it matches the vibe, and I might have to do it. I might actually end up putting this on just because. I don't know about placement because right here it looks pretty good. I was also, I was also thinking like maybe off to the side, something a little bit more discreet, or maybe at the like, right, right at the bottom. I don't know yet, but I do think I'm putting the Nismo badge on, y'all. I don't know. What you, let me know what y'all think in the comment section below, y'all. Let me know what y'all think. Y'all fuck with the Nismo badge? Y'all think like I should just not do it? But let's go put the grill on, y'all. I'm tired of sitting around looking at this. Let's just go put it on. Yeah. Hey. There we go. Hey. Oh, there you go. Final touch. What? I didn't need the impossible. She ride like a carnival. Having flashbacks, she gon' heat me up like a carnival. It's the way I pop my. I'm not ready. I'm going clean, man. That is clean. Tell me not what. But all these chrome accents, this small chrome touch with this and this, this, what? What? Hold on, hold on, y'all. I got, I gotta get the, the Nismo badge. You gotta see what the Nismo badge looks like, y'all. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna put the grill. I'm thinking about putting the badge in the grill. I've been talking about it for a minute. I actually got my friend right here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have him, I'm gonna have him hold it so I can see it from far and see how it looks like in the distance. Just give me a second, right quick. All right, guys. First of all, bro, bro, bro. Look at, look at the black grill, bro. Fire, yeah, 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 that shit's tough, right? Why are you fucking on my car, bro? Why are you fucking on my car, bro? Nigga, get your get my car, nigga. Anyways, all right, so, 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 I, I, I. Bro, I don't know, bro. I'm contemplating it, bro. I want to I wanna add that shit. Contemplating? I want to add that shit, bro, but, like, it, it looks so clean without it, bro. But with it, but with it, it's like, okay, it's a little touch, you know? Why are you on the back? On the back, nigga? Let's go to the back. What are you saying? What do you think? Bro, I thought about, I think it looked weird in the middle, bro. I wish I could just put it, like, right here type shit. Right here, nigga. Nah, bro. The back middle, of the huh? Back of the maybe if it was smaller. You think if it was smaller, maybe? Oh, gee. Bro, I feel like I don't think I'm gonna do it, bro. This shit looks tough, though. I'm not gonna do it. it look clean, though, like. Yeah, it look clean. It look mad simple with it, bro. Yeah, bro. No front plate, nigga. That shit looks clean. Yeah, nigga, I should just put this on the side, bro. Side skirt. And this more bad. Yeah, nah. Put that there, nigga. That shit tough, nigga. This one bad, yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, low key, low key. That's what it's talking about. Low key. Uh, I just want to give y'all a big thank you for tuning into this video and checking out the grill install, y'all. Cause I'm not gonna lie, yeah, I've been a little bit, I've been a little bit down, y'all. I went through some mods and I ain't had no mods to do because the weather's been bad, it's been snowing and stuff. And it's been pretty bad outside, but now we got some good weather and I'm ready to be outside, you know. I'm ready to be outside, do some stuff. But let me know what you guys are fucking with, what you guys want to see next. I got some couple things lined up I'm going to be doing as well. So stay tuned for that stuff as well. And thank you guys for subscribing as well. Because, you know, it may not be big. It may not be at like 1,000. It may not be at 10,000 or 20. But, but if it was like 300 of y'all in the room with me right now, and we talking about cars, but I'll be having a good ass time, y'all, with y'all niggas. So I'm not going to lie, y'all. I appreciate everybody's tuning in and checking this and checking me out. Thank you guys. Big shout out to y'all. So, peace.